a big welcome back viewers I think I've sorted out that um, sort of pallet problem I don't know I'll, I'll get my ute back and just have to do the fuel come on mate what a good start anyway we're off to get rid of some wood chips we've got heaps of them half a million tons so I expect to be six hundred thousand dollars after we do this and we'll be laughing Oh, the snow's back out. We had a day yesterday in the middle of winter with no snow, which was nice. I got a fair bit done. So, yeah. I'm going to get round there. Okay, let's see how our first load goes. I'm tipping... How much was there? 150. Could be a hundred. Could it be 165,000 or 100? I don't know. It's looking pretty good, but how much was it? 192,000 dollars. Come on. Well. How about that? Now I've got some wood chip up at the top farm. So I might take this opportunity to um, go up and get that. And we'll bring it down and we'll take all our wood chip in and then we can think about we're going to buy the shingle factory, the barrel factory. Um, we need to buy another sheep pen for the one we had to replace. Touch wood, I haven't had any conflicts no blue screen since I got rid of that sheep pen which is unfortunate because um, it was only $12,000 and it held about 300 sheep so but um, I'm sure they'll that'll it'll all come out in the wash and um, hopefully it'll be fixed up so I can use it on you know other farms but yeah and um, other than that I've bought a new trailer. There's a few new trailers I've tried out. I'm not really happy with any of them. I think I'm going to go back to my four-wheel drive and hopefully they'll fix the update soon. Jesus, look out, mate. Yeah, so hopefully it'll get an update soon. To, I don't know why suddenly it's... It must be since the... Um, since the Giants update. It's the way I see it. It only seems to be since then. So yeah, we'll have to um, work that out. Then we need to get our tree stuff down to where we're working at the moment. We've bought that field three and we've done a bit of work out the back, freed up a bit more room. We might extend the field or we might, I don't know, put some pigs down there. But um, yeah. Pretty sure I showed you that new shed. Then again, it might have been in the stuff that I had to edit out. Uh, there's so many things on those silos. Come on. Wood chips, 316. There's two loads here, so I'm going to take these two loads down, and um, then we'll get back down to the main, the large farm, and we'll keep going from there. So here we are back again, viewers, and we're coming up for what'll be our last load. As you can see, we've got well over a million dollars, and um, we've still got 200,000 left. But we'll take the 150, and then we'll um, we'll keep the 50 up our sleeve for next year. And we're still here next year. We should be now. One of the first things I'm going to do, I'm going to pay the majority of that loan off. Uh, the, 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 the loan bribe, if you know what I mean. And um, But we won't pay it all off. I was talking to Eddie about it and he said, if you pay them all off, they'll want more. And we haven't launched our first boat yet. So we want our first boat launched. Then we want to start running a campaign and, that, and that'll put the wind up them. And they'll try to make friends and, you know, yeah, they won't want to be on our offside just in case we do win. And if we don't win, well, it might be time to move on anyway. At least the people will be able to come back here and the people will all love us. Eddie also suggested I could always marry someone from the town, but... I've only seen men so far with contracts and that. 
That's how you make girls, isn't it? Do contracts on their farms. <laughs> So off we go, we'll take this last one over, we're going to crack 1.5 million dollars. Said that a little bit like Dr. Evil then, didn't I? And um, we're going to, without haste, we're going to buy these factories we need. Well, with haste, without delay, I should say. Oh, look out, we've kicked it up a little. We need to go down and buy a shitload of pl sh uh, planks, just short ones. I'm wondering if the bales I've got in the top bale shed up near on the small farm are, are, taking, are being counted. If they are, I'll have to bring them down and empty them into that. Um, I might buy it for only 25 grand or whatever it is. I might buy another shed, make it a bale shed. We'll see. Anyway, look at that, 1.5 million dollars. So what's this next place along here? What do they make here? Let's have a look. Oh, get out of it. Wood turn. Bowls, pepper grinders, staircase case railing. We needed that, that's part of the roller coaster. I think to make the roller coaster you have to have all the businesses, which is, you know, gets you to use the town sort of stuff. Now I think that this might be the barrel factory here. Ah, that's Doris's. We're driving on the wrong side of the road. Where the hell's the barrel factory? Aha, what's this over here? What's that say? Barrel making. Okay. 120? No problem. Well, I'm going to go and buy the shingle factory and then I'll be back again. So here we are, viewers. It doesn't look like it at the moment, but there's a field underneath this ice pack. And we've cleared a lot of room out up the end here, which we could possibly extend the field or put some sort of a production in there or something but you can see the field goes to there there's a few rocks in here but I could make it come out a little longer or we could put a couple of production buildings or but yeah that needs cleaning up a little bit needs a bit of a tidy up this is a nice place over here this um not sure if it's the church it's pretty cool but we'll grab our header I reckon we might as well get another loading while we can what say you let's keep going while the going's, going's good because there's 50,000 in that front front thing I'm not going to worry about the stumps because I'm going to bring the stump gear and that up here to clear up the stumps and the rocks. This is fairly flat here. This would be something, you know, good location there. If you do want to get rid of the stumps, lift it up, move forward, drop it down. Seems to work on most of them unless you cut them too high and you can't get it up above them. But up, forward, down. Take these trees out here. Up. Forward. 
down. Okay. Well, we'll be able to get something right out here on the point. Maybe this is where we should have our house. I'll keep going with this, I'll fill this up and take it up and empty it, and then we'll continue on our merry way. Well viewers, it wasn't my intention to buy the house just yet, but check that out. Bang! <laughs> what a beauty. Let's run down and have a bit of a look. I hope we can go inside. Oh, <laughs> turn it up. Look at this. Can you light the fire? Oh, hey, do they tape it? Oh, bullshit. This is the best ever. Don't tell me the barbecue starts. No, but I can move it. Oh, man. There's even a loft. What's going on up here? Oh, man. This is something else. Hey, got a laundry. Left a bit of toilet. Oh, check out that bathtub. <laughs> yeah, and the basin. Oh, come on. How cool is this? Better shut the uh, front veranda here. It's a bit um, a bit chilly out. Well, I'm going to chill at the house for a little while. Johnny can Oh, geez, the front door's open. Thought I could feel a draft on me back. This is the sweetest. I'm going to stand here and look out the window next to the fireplace. Once I get sick of doing that, I might do some more work. Then again, I might not. Oh, that's what we might do before we go. Um, where's our loan? Dollars. Loan, 160. Pay, 5. Pay it down to 30. We've still got over a million bucks. How good have we gone? <laughs> right. Alright. See you shortly. Well, that's enough for that looking out the window, viewers. So here we are. We're, um... We've brought the... Last load of wood chips down. Doesn't seem to want to sell. Here we go. Now I've got an extra 50,000 this time because we've brought the header with us and it, the actual machine on the front holds 50,000. So yeah, we're only expecting over 200 here. So that'll be good. Two fifty-five. Hell yeah. <laughs> Alright, so, now what I've noticed in my travels, well we might go around and check again, we can always do that, go down to the boatyard, and um, I think we need some metal down there to get it to the next stage. I don't know if all that stuff was there on the roller coaster before. Maybe we're making some headway, maybe we need to check that too. And again we've got to get some animals and all the rest of it, we've got plenty to do. Busy, busy. So we'll cruise in here. Five hundred and ninety two metal. It says we've got metal in storage. Oh, five ninety one. Anyway, it doesn't matter. So we'll whiz back over to the the main farm.
Oh, boy, ah. Bit of indecision there. Let's play right of you. Watch out, mate. Put our wood chipper away. I love the way that drives through there, haven't you? Pick up some grass. No, we don't need. Let's just check something out first. Going to go in and see Eddie. We're going to pick ourselves up a trailer. What do you got for his brother? In the miscellaneous, there's a, a this one here. Look, doesn't say how much it holds. What's that one there? Box it. Doesn't say anything about auto load. Mm, well, it'd have to be, wouldn't it? into it without it and that goes on the back of the TLX just bear with me viewers now this one here on the end it takes everything I think don't worry about the worlds we don't have that terrible colour let's get an orange one rim colour Jet black. I just want to check what we own in the way of cars. Let's say TLX 3500. Okay. Here's our new box at trailer it up to the old girl here. Now it'd be interesting to see how this works. This, I don't know if we've gone through this since I moved it. Maybe we haven't. Here's the new this is the new pallet storage system, but you need a forklift to put it in there. We may have covered this, I'm not quite sure. But you pull up, it doesn't automatically take it. So what we're going to do here, we've got some stuff in there as you can see. So we're going to take out pallet metal a thousand. One. go. There's a pallet of metal. Hopefully this trailer is going to pick that up. God, I thought that wasn't working then for a second. Well, we might just go for a bit of a shortcut here, which could turn out to be a bad idea. <laughs> so we can see our metal in the back there. Oh, look out. We've got ourselves a drag race. Now we'll pull up over here.
This should give us an unload prompt. Oh. Well, it's just gone. Okay, no unload prompt. Prompt, it just goes. Metal 581. It must be working away in here then. There's, there's enough there's enough there to cover it so I can't understand what's going on anyway I'm happy with this trailer so later on I'll drive it up the top I think we may have some flour in that to um, to sell. I'm not sure if I sold the flour. I can't recall. So how are we going on our roller coaster? Planks and staircase railing. Okay. I don't know what we can do here because I, I bought some planks. What happens when you don't plan ahead, sir? Could have already been down here getting that. Gee, I miss me, me Jeep. Might buy one anyway, even if we have got to put the fuel in every time we stop. <laughs> All that. A bit painful, but it's a lot easier to reverse than this. Oh, thank God, the snow's finally disappearing. Well, I do like the winner. Gives a really good look to the game. It was nice down at the house, in there with the fire on. So I wonder if we can go in the bottom door. We're going to fit. Oh, the bottom door looks a bit smaller, I think. <laughs> this will be dodgy, I think. We might get stuck here. What are you talking about, Ranger? We should be using that forklift too. You don't have to necessarily use it here. I wonder if they'll let you change the attachments on the front. Well, there we go. I think those are planks. And they're beams. Got ten of ten of each. Well uh, doesn't look like there's ten of each. Six and six, so they stack them in sixes. Come on, baby. about all planks. Yeah, if everything's working properly it won't take those. Yeah. We get out of here. Yeah. So, not quite sure what uses what, so let's go and have a look. So I've got 10,000 planks. 
wooden railings. Where do we make those? Hmm. Good question. Tell you what, it's lovely out. It's still winter. You wouldn't think so. Real nip in the air. It's very cool, but it's very nice. So let's see what we need to drop off here and what this place does. I think it's just a barrel factory. Barrels. What do they what do they need for barrels? Materials missing. Barrel. Planks long metal. Planks long. Okay. Was that the barrel factory we actually looked at then? Or did we just look at the second one and assume it was it? No, it was. Planks long. Okay. Pretty sure there's another place just up here. Let's see what we've got here. Shingle Company. Let's see what they take. Materials missing. Oh, huh. dickhead. Gotta press on this one. Uh, planks long. So, here I was thinking, oh, we'll just buy heaps and heaps of short planks. Because we, um, ex pet accessories. So where's the other place I need? Where's the furniture store? Is it, it doesn't make the railings. Anyway, leave it with me, viewers. We'll, we'll waste some time here. So down here at the lumber yard again, and um, we need planks long. <coughs> Excuse me, by tent. Forty-two thousand dollars. It's a bit much, isn't it? cost to make this freaking roller coaster. Anyway, we've got this um, Telex 2020 version with a box on the back. This is a lovely looking car. There's one problem I've got with it, which is not a really a... It's like, you'll see when I drive it. It, um... <laughs> it has a tendency to have a little bit of sway. It needs a couple of sway bars. Look at that, that's taken both piles at once. Can we get tricky here? Come on, tricky. Oh, oh, turn it up. Look at this. That's beautiful. So I finally found a trailer that still works properly. The other one, the, the one that I'm going to drive up to the top, to the small farm, it wouldn't unload. I had to unload it on the ground and then get the forklift to lift them up because I couldn't lift them. Need to do that 15, I reckon 15 goes on the roller coaster gives you super strength. That sure could come in handy. So I want to sort of divide this up a little bit. And put 10 in the shingle factory and 10 in the whatever else it is we need to make. Maybe the barrel factory. I don't know. We'll work it out in a minute. Now look at this thing. <laughs> She's dodgy. I've already flipped it once, but it was quite easy to get back on its wheels again, but... Yeah, she dodgy as. I'm gonna go down here and start making some... Oh, there's something down here we need for the roller coaster. Is it chairs? What's this place? Barrels. Oh, 
Oh, that's cool. That's cool. This it is something that actually works well. That's good. Well, no, the materials aren't missing unless I put in the wrong thing. Bathtubs. Storing. Oh, I need metal. Oh, we can do that. So I whiz over here to... Is this a shingle factory? <laughs> He's a bit rock and rolly, but hey. It's working. I'm very impressed by that. It's just like having our old Jeep Cherokee back. No more room for planks long. Start this up. Shingles. Running storage. Mm, what is this? Does this place here take planks? Picture frame and joint? Yes, it does. Okay, so let's um, I'll just leave it. We, well, I know something we can do. Let's whiz down here. And, um, we need to get some timber up to the timber yard to make the prefab walls and that. But wooden beams is the main thing. I can't believe we paid eighty thousand dollars for that. It's like that's that's ridiculous. It really is. So we don't want to be doing that too often. Okay. Hope I haven't walked up the ground too much here from where I put the last thing. Construction. Come on. Animals. Sheep. There's one down here. Looks like the in-game ones, but it holds more sheep or something. That one there. It says it's a sheep pen large. overlapping with hmm. 137 137 can't see, see this nothing there for it to overlap with. One thirty eight, one thirty seven. So that's a bit crooked. You can tell there uh, the way that's going down into the ground. I don't like that. That sucks a bit. Let's see if we can put it down here. Well, obviously, I'm going to have to do some more homework. Sorry about this, viewers. I was pretty sure that would plonk right there where the last one... Oh now, oh, now it wants to go. Oh, now it doesn't. What's going on? What could I be? Why is it saying overlapping? Is it 
we've got like <laughs> we're gonna have to get it up and running to see what happens here but um yeah <laughs> I don't know what's going on <laughs> I'll be back <laughs> So here we are viewers, I know how excited you guys get about me buying the sheep, so let's get into it. We'll get some of these bar bar black sheep here, buy the 60. Thank you. And we'll top her up with uh, some bar bar brown sheep. Would it let us buy 60? Oh, look at them. <laughs> That's why it was overlapping. It's got this huge pasture. What a wanker. Oh, well. Oh, yeah, they're free roam sheeps. Give them a bit of grass here. I hope it holds a fair bit of grass because it holds a fair few sheep. It should take this 45. That'd be nice. We would have to be down here every second day. It'd probably take 1500. Twenty something's not too bad. We can whiz over and check on the other sheeps while we're here. See how the wool's going. We've actually got the trailer over there ready. Let's go for an overtake and maneuver over the crossing. Yeah. Any fabric? Oh yeah, got a bit of fabric. Two pallets. Grass is probably ready to mow. While well, it's growing. Sort of a bit annoying with my no rolling policy how whenever you look at something it says, you know, there's always something in blue. Like it needs rolling, you know, and it, oh, it's not sort of perfect, but yeah. Uh, well, a bit more wool there. I don't know that this will take all this, but it'll go close. It fits through here nice and easily, I know that. We're a fine looking bunch of sheep. take a little shortcut here, I don't know if I've done this before, but um, if you head down here, I'm thinking about making a road along here. Cut out all that bit over on the right over there. That doesn't seem like we're actually getting anywhere, but I think we are. <laughs> I don't know, time will tell. to figure out what to plant down on that bottom field yet. I'll tell you what we are going to do. Oh, we won't do it just yet. Do we know those bale forks? I don't... I don't think we do. I'm going to get rid of that trailer. Um, so what we own... Uh, skid steer tools... Check our episode length. Be back. We might lash out and buy a new tractor while we've got money. I'll see you then. <laughs> 